Welcome back to Ashina Sports. And today, African Cup qualifiers is coming on your way, and it is going to be a uh, Sao Sao Tame Prince there is going to face Nigeria today, and it's going to be absolutely beautiful, beautiful game. And hey, we just leveled some few minutes for it to uh, start. And let's take a look at the lineup and see how both are passing into this game. And let's see how things are melting things and things are going to be passing. Nigeria is going to face some, uh, uh, some Tommy and Principe. Okay. <laughs> Let's take a look at the lineup as well and see how this is going to be. So, Sao, Tommy, and Principe home do their lineup is here, and we have uh, Brakanka. Brakanka on goal post, they are playing 4 4 2 formation. Suarez, we have Vegas, we have Pequino, and we have Nazari in the back 4 4 uh, Principe. We also have Veggies. Veggies, Santos, and also Damata, Damata, and also Vegas. There's a lot of Vegas in this lineup as well. And in midfield, that is the four we have. And also the striking, we have Luis Suleimani and also Liao. These are the two making up the uh, the, the, the lineup of uh, Principe. And let's take a look at Nigeria lineup as we left with just five minutes for the game to kick start. And hey, here we are and what we are. Nigeria is also playing for two, two formation here. And you will see, hey, their goalkeeper is in here as well. And he is Uzo. Uzo who is once again playing for them. Aina is also also in there once again, and Samusi, Ajayi, and also Basi. This their last game. This four was the guys that make up the defensive phase of Nigeria. And hey, let's see how this is gonna be working, and let's see how things are going to be amazing here. And hey, in midfield we have Wobi, Wobi, and also a table, a table in midfield for. Uh, Nigeria and we have Lukman in the right wing and we also have Simon in the left wing and Osimhin and Murphy is playing the striking role for Nigeria. Eddie <laughs> Principe and Nigeria. Nigeria is traveling away from home this time round. And last time we saw them uh, beat uh, Sierra Leone by two goals to one. And hey, I probably was thinking Sierra Leone was better in that game, but yet Nigeria was too strong for them. And today it is Principe away from home. What do you think about this game as well? All right, so it's another day for us to witness the qualification after a couple of last four qualifications. And today, Nigeria traveling far, far from home to play against our Tommy. But with everything, Nigeria, Nigeria is a better side, the place and everything, because they were, their last game they played, they won their last game, as well as. Uh, Told me also lost their lost their first game. So probably Nigeria with the upper with the better side, looking forward to probably pick all the three points from this. From this game. But as I said, Sao Tommy also have no points, but from those also be with the home advantage, they're also trying to probably pick all the three points. So in this case, what we're talking about, let's see what things will turn around. But Nigeria, as I said, has their upper hand. So Nigeria have a upper hand in this game. And Eddie, if you go uh, signing you into your side because it's like my destiny is played now, I can't control anything right now. I don't know what is really happening. And if I restart it to cut off. So if you can log into your side, like the way we did the last time, logging into your side as well, because I cannot actually, my screen is blurred at this moment. I need to restart this system because I don't know why. All right, all okay. right. So, move. okay, let me. Yeah, it's still the same thing. Okay. Let me try it from here. Let me try it from here. Let me try it from here. So, when you log in, then probably maybe I'll be able to do a lot of stuff here. And, guys, just give us a couple of minutes as you log in. Probably I'll be able to start my PC and be able to come back. Just log in. 
open the register, not the one you know how we do it now. <laughs> because I can't see anything at this moment. I don't know what's really happened. Yesterday, or when the DJ voice it was doing the same thing. I don't know what is happening. Today. Nigeria is buzzing into this game, and Nigeria is the one. And it's a good harvest for Nigeria this time round. I think they will be able to make it happen because, hey, Prince Pair is just a new. They don't have a lot of experience when it comes to African tournament because they have not been really involved in African country, African uh, Cup of Nations and qualification. But they will be happy to also qualify into the African Cup of Nations as well. But let's see how this is going to be. And then if you log in, let me know. Let me know. Guys, just give us a couple of minutes and give us a couple of minutes. It's going to be okay and everything is going to be fine as well. So let me know your opinions and suggestions. Were you able to log in? Yes, I am. Oh, fuck. Nah. Okay, let me see, let me see. Because it's, it locked me out. No, no, it's, it's locked me out. Everything has been, so let me... <laughs> let me come. Let's see what is really happening right now. Just click. How were you able to log? Just log in. Click on log in. Let me see what I saw there. It's already logged me out. So it's not logging in. Invalid password. Not to see invalid email. Check the email. It's not Al Hassan. Edith first, let me find out. Other than that, we need to restart everything because it already locked me out. I want to see what I... Okay, so it is so. Okay. Password, password. Huh? So try to log in again. Just refresh and log in again. Okay. The S should be capital. Guys, just give us a couple of minutes and what is happening. It means we need to restart everything because my computer is just, I don't know, give me a couple of minutes. Let me see something from my phone. Because I don't want to end this stream. Thank <laughs> you. 
It's not working, right? Huh? It's not working. Okay, so good. So uh, scroll down. Okay, so click. Is it is it the same game? Is it the Nigerian game? Huh? Yeah, that is it. It's still live. So just click on it. Click on the Nigerian game, not the Sierra Leone one. So still scroll down. Let me see. So go down. So, wow. One good, I didn't see that one. Yeah, that one is on top. I don't know why you can't see it below there. Okay, so okay, be there. Let me just try to restart and see maybe because I don't know. We have to start everything and time is going. What if? It's not able to write this thing. I don't know. Okay, and you, you can join. We are still live. Okay, thanks God, thank God, thank God, thank God. And guys, let's see. <laughs> this is gonna work out, and let's see how things are really going to be working for sure. Because I was really, really pissing off at this moment, guys. If you just join us, remember to be part of this amazing community where your opinions and suggestions are highly, highly welcome. Eddie, we're still live, so you can. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Come on, guys, we will be joining the action in any moment from now, and we will be joining in any moment from now. And come on, it is what it is, and it is absolutely beautiful, beautiful game. And hey, let's see what Nigeria is a goal harvest for Nigeria today. If they fail to score more than five goals here, then it means we cannot say more about but then we cannot say much about Nigeria, but today you need to go and make it a master architect here. And guys, if you just join us, remember to subscribe and be part of this amazing community where your opinions and suggestions are highly welcome. I don't know what really happened to my PC and everything just went boom. And guys, we are still here and we are still here making it for sure. Whatever the cap fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. Who do you think probably will win this game? Is it Nigeria? Keep your comments coming, keep your suggestions coming. And hey, it is just a master architect of a game. And these two could just be making it a great moment here. Now
whoever the Catholic where he can let him where he can I'm waiting. What we bring you is what we think is gonna be best and it is the best for us. And hey, the last two years days we've been talking about we've been talking about the Euro uh, nations and this time now we are here again and guess who is here? Eddie so actually to the world absolutely actually to the world and also hey from edisa google actually africa absolutely and guys if you just get nine minutes or ten minutes into the game and it's still same story and still same story and let's see who is who in this game if you just join be part of it and be part of it Eddie, what do you think guys you can also like and share the video as well and let's see who all right so yes nigeria already Forgotten the first goal in the game. Yeah. Forgotten the lead in the I told game. you. So I told you, if Nigeria doesn't score, score up to five goals here today, then they are not the team we really think they are. But hey, let's see how this is going to work out and let's see how things are really going to be amazing for these two sides. And whoever the car fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, we are masters of our own game we are masters of our team and hey what is going on guys what are your opinions going into these games i cannot believe what i'm seeing in nigeria all the way and all the way from principe what can they do and what will they be doing here because i have upgraded nigeria if they fail to score five goals today i'm not going to support nigeria again if they fail to score five green games here, I'm not going to support Nigeria again, guys. I am saying it for life, and I'm saying it for life here. Yeah. I said it. If they fail to score five goals, then I'm not going to support the Super Eagles in any competition again. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. It is just what it is and it is absolutely what it is and whoever they can fit, let them wear it and let them wear it and at this moment I can be sure and I can be sure is going to make it a master architect here and whoever they can let them wear it, let them wear it and I'm waiting and waiting and waiting. Come on guys. We are who we are, what we are is what we do, and what we do is what we bring you. We bring you the most exciting game here, and the most exciting game is here. What is it to you? Like I said, Nigeria with their comfortable lead, absolutely. Into 12 minutes of this game, Nigeria is the master architect here, and if they don't get up to 7 goals or 5 goals in this game, then forget, I'm not going to support Super Eagles again. Eddie, this is just amazing and beautiful, beautiful day for both sides, and I think they could just be buzzing and buzzing and buzzing. Let me know your opinions going into this game. Let me know what you think about the game, because it's getting messier and it's getting messier in the side of the Super Eagles. Yes. What is really transpiring here? The, what is really transpiring here, guys? This is just amazing. This is just beautiful. And let me know your opinions going into this game. Let me know what you think about the game because the game is simple, the best at this moment. It's simple, that it's simple. What we think it is. It's just incredible, incredible game and absolutely incredible game. Come on guys, come on guys. It's just a class and it's just a class. I think what do you think second half? How many goals do you think Nigeria will be able to get in the second half of this game? 
Another one coming in from Edward said, is the first half going to be brutal? Yeah, the first half is going to be absolutely brutal. It's going to be absolutely massive, massive win for Nigeria. And I think Nigeria first half will score up to two to three goals today. And take just for 14 minutes in, Nigeria is already passing with that win. And hey, let's see how things are getting messier here and let's see how things are really going here victor or sinhin the only striker in the in nigeria team that i respect victor or sinhin nine minutes into the game and he just made it on and he just scored the goal for nigeria and i think hey this was just a master class and master architect of both sides and guys let me know what you think let me know your suggestions and opinions because this is absolutely massive absolutely great game and hey massive massive work from the both side and hey as we go on we are all into the mercy of the lord and hey Principe is just on the mercy of the Lord because Nigeria is not going to do any forgiveness here. They are not going to give any forgiveness. They need it for their confidence. They need it for the massiveness of the game and they need it for the uh, intensity of the game. So let's see how this is going to be. Come on, guys. I can't believe what it is and I can't believe what we are doing right now. Okay, whoever they have it, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, we will see. Hey, this player is not actually getting, they are just playing also a beautiful game here, uh, <laughs> preventing the Super Eagles from getting in. And this was just offside. Nigeria is too quick and they are too hesitating to score more goals here. Victor or Simeon is the one just getting in and hey, he is still offside here, he couldn't place himself well. Let me know what you think. Eddie, it's just like, because they know they need to get more goals into this, they're just hesitating to get the goals in. And it looks like things are not really getting better and it's not getting better at all. But today, let's see how this is going to be and let's see how things are really going to be working for this two side. Oh, come on guys, I can't believe what I'm seeing and I can't believe whatever is going on but whatever we are doing here is just the betterment of the trophy and the betterment of qualification. I did a fail to qualify to African World Cup for sure but this African Cup of Nations they need to be passing over there and they are favorite going into it and I think something will just be changing for sure and let me know your opinions and suggestions let me know your opinions and say let me know what you think about the game and if you just join us make sure to subscribe be part of this amazing community hey corner kick to nigeria once again corner kick to nigeria again what possible is going to be changing here? What possible is going to be in the game of tools like this? Come on, guys. It's just amazing and it's just absolutely amazing. 17 minutes into the game, Nigeria is already passing with one goal to go and they are seeing like just want the goals in and just want the goals in. And hey, the referee will be tired this time around and a lot of offside. But this, I don't think this was offside, but hey. Prince is in their usual green, green, green jersey. Nigeria is in the green and white jersey at this moment. But hey, they are looking very, very comfortable here. And let's see how the super eagles, the super eagles of Niger. As I said, I need five goals. I need Super Eagles to score five goals. If they fail to do it, then I'm not going to support Super Eagles again. But 18 minutes into the game, they are still hanging on to just the one goal lead. What is happening? What is happening? And you don't you think they are too reluctant on the ball and they are too like another corner for Nigeria? I see at all the possession of everything of the statistic, Nigeria should be able to own it, but the spirit are not actually allowing Nigeria to do whatever they want and whatever they like. But they are also yeah, here to prove their points and they are also yes, the goals and everything, but the goals will come. 
to the most fun. Well, well, as you say, the ghost will come for me. I don't have that patience. <laughs> My problem is the patience. <laughs> My problem is the patience. I don't have that patience to be waiting and waiting and waiting. I just need the ghost to come quick, quick. But hey, <laughs> it looks like the principal was just okay. That was a safe from their goalkeeper as well. But let's see how things are going to be. <laughs> 10 minutes into the game, it's still one goal to be on. And hey, it is just the Super Eagles getting in and controlling every step of their way. And as at this moment, four shots into the game, one one on target, 71% of ball possession. And Prisper in the other hand, just zero shot, zero on target, and 20% of ball possession. This is what we game of thrones, a game of thrones. And Nigeria, as at this moment, is leading the table with a comfortable lead of six points if it stays like this. But hey, Guinea-Bissau was able to Guinea-Bissau was able to get to get these people five goals to nil. I don't know what Nigeria is waiting for. I don't know why they are hesitating into this game. 20 minutes no goal yet. I'm just I'm just not comfortable with this kind of with this kind of players. Come on. Come on, you super angels. Who is who in this game? Who is the master architect in this game? And it's probably Nigeria. But hey, one goal, I don't think it's enough. Call yourself champions of Africa or win into the African Cup of Nation to make it a master architect here. But once you follow, you follow. What you follow, you follow, and that is exactly what I'm waiting and this is exactly what I'm looking up forward for. I'm looking forward to see this kind of massive, uh, this kind of uh, 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 agency in Nigeria will be able to play, but that agency is still missing here. 21 minutes into the game, it's still the same story, and it's still one goal to be up. So, Eddie, what is just passing here? The game is not an interest, I'm just enjoying the game over here. That's what? Nigeria having having fun with the ball, they are just enjoying the game over there as well. Having a great time. But still, 20 minutes in the game, Nigeria is already having their upper hand in the game, already leading by one goal to the other. Let's see how things will turn around. But this game has a lot to offer, probably in goals in the middle. In terms of goals and everything. Yeah, because they just that them, every one of them will have their energy and hey, I like the detail of the uh, Sao players because they are actually doing quite very well in the pitch, preventing Nigeria in their midfield area and also what they are doing right now, which is to take long balls and to be able to find their strikers as well. But all of the person right now is not working for them and it's not working for them. And see, a long shot and the goalkeeper was able to actually get on board and make it happen. So they are preventing Nigeria from creating spaces. But Nigeria started with long shots from this stance. But let's see how it's going and let's see how things are going to be better here. Because for me, I think if Nigeria failed to score five goals today, then believe me, I'm not going to support them in any competition again. Because the disappointment is too much, but I need, I need, I need that moment. Don't you, don't, don't you think you're expecting, too, don't you think you're expecting too much from them? Guinea, Guinea Bissau, Guinea Bissau to Trinidad, uh, Sao, uh, uh, Tommy, and also Principe scored five goals to nil. So I, I, I wanted Nigeria to even score ten goals. So if Guinea can score four five goals to nil, Nigeria should be able to score seven or ten goals. But I'm limiting them to the same five because it's a football game. You understand? I'm not like I expected much. I need I need the players to do a lot of job because there are a lot of times they are world class players who are the world known. Name a player you know from uh, South. You can't even remember. You can't even know. But Nigeria have the quality. They have the players in 
So I need them to come in and make it a master architect here. That is what I'm talking about. Yeah, but once you know, old boy is full of surprise. Although getting one one against them five zero to zero, they might yeah. even win against Nigeria. That's how football. That's how football is. I know that is how football is. But believe it or not, when was the how, when was the last time you see them? in qualification like the one was the last time you see them playing African Cup of Nation. Not to talk of playing, this is just their recent recent days coming into the football world and I think they are quite doing perfectly but not to the standard of Nigeria. Come on Eddie, we know games, there are surprises in the games but not this kind of games. Guys, if you haven't subscribed, let's see what happens. Mm-hmm. Let's see what happens. And I'm my fingers crossed, guys, because I am tired of this disappointment. And then need to score five goals. If they fail, then I'm not going to support them again in order in any competition. Believe me. This is what I'm giving them. It is my target. It is my target. It is my personal opinion. Guys, if you have your opinion as well, let me know in the comment section because I cannot wait to see them smash goals here because today is going to be a goal harvest for Nigeria and a goal harvest for Nigeria. They should go in and happen. And hey, let me know your opinions as well. Because if you are too tired as well, let me know. If you think Nigeria cannot score five goals in this game, let me know in the comment section. And also, if you haven't liked the video, do me a favor, like the video and subscribe as well. Because we, our target this month is 2K. And we could possibly be helping us to reach there as well. And let's see how things are going to be smashing here. But hey, let me know what you think because Nigeria to Nigeria today should be able to get in and make it a master architect score more than five goals or five goals in the game. Principe are defending, yeah, I understand, but Nigeria is the master architect here and will do anything possible. Because if Guinea Bissau can score goals to nil, Nigeria should be able to score more goals here. Believe me, I still believe in the Super Eagles. I believe in them every single day. And the last game you could see the tonacity, the intent, the intention they brought into the game. And so even though Sierra Leone was able to get a goal against Nigeria at home, but you can't compare Sierra Leone and South together. Absolutely. So Nigeria is stopping. The- this group and they need to talk it around to score that equally five goals here so that in terms of goals if it comes to goals they can get the goals if it comes to points they have the points and that is all what i need from nigeria and guys if you just join me let me know your opinions and suggestions if you haven't subscribed make it a point to subscribe turn on your notification bell like and share the video as well let our old and let our friends come on and enjoy it as much as possible because hey it's just a master architect of a game and these two are really proving me that they are ready to make it happen come on you super eagles but remember nine nine minutes into the game victor or is the master architect and he is the master architect in this game and he is taking the flag to the higher and he is the one who probably make the difference in this game and Nigeria is leading one goal to nil and hey, I'm very very excited and I'm very very excited that Nigeria is consistently winning their game and if they take it like this to the African Cup of Nations next year believe me hey this is going to be the trophy is going to come from if they just play an impact game if they play a, a composure game if they play with their heart not for money but just for the flag for the patriotism for the hard work because nigerian people are all hard workers they are all hard workers just that some few are not going to just support them because of Yes, I told you the second goal is in and the second goal is in. Absolutely amazing and absolutely great, great, great day. I told you I'm waiting for it. Two or three goals in the first half will be absolutely cracker for me. And right now, they are doing exactly that and I'm just happy. Guys, if you haven't subscribed, make it a point to subscribe. Turn on the notification bell as well. And let's see how these super eagles will turn around. Another one coming in from 
Suleiman is Sunny said, Yo, you got this, you got this, you got this, you got this. Good five, elbow up and down. <laughs> Do the five and, and star home. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Suleiman. And hey, I'm really, really appreciative. And hey, this is the second goal Nigeria is getting in. I'm, I'm really, really happy that this is coming at this time. In the 29th minute of the game, Nigeria is leading by two goals to nil. What a master architect. What a master architect Super Eagles is blowing here. And they will just take from nowhere, top the group. No one is going to dispute them in that group table and I want them to qualify alongside with uh, 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 Sierra Leone because Sierra Leone are also just fantastic. But let's see how this is going to be. Let's see how things are going to be dazzling here because we are dazzling. Why? Because Nigeria is leading by two goals to nil. Two goals to nil on the point and two goals to nil at this moment is just what I mean. Moses Simon Simon is the one who scored the second goal as well from Nigeria and these two sides. I know, I know what Simon can do from the win side and I know what Osim Him can do as well. And hey, this is just a comfortable lead and a massive comfortable lead for Nigeria. And hey, I'm still, I still said it, five goals today is the minimum I think Nigeria. If they fail to score it, I'm not going to support Super Eagles in any competition, believe it or not. But hey, let me know your opinion as well let me know your suggestions as well because it is just a master architect and a great 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 time to be here as well and we take everyone your opinions your suggestions whatever you think about the game bring it on and let's celebrate on it and let's enjoy this game for today because we need to enjoy for a quite a long time this is just a master architect and a masterpiece pieces that Super Eagles is bringing together to make it a formidable one. I need it and I need it and we all need it as an Africa collectively. We all need it because we all know the ranking. We all know FIFA ranking lies in Africa and in FIFA. So this is not a game for them to just say, now nah, we need to joke, we need to play around, smash in the goals, smash in the goals. Another one coming in from Edward said, more Fire ashram. More fire ashram. That is it. That is it. That is it. I am just a great and I'm just a master architect here. Whatever we are doing here is what we are doing for you. And what we are doing is what we are getting from you. And what we are getting is just the excitement. And the excitement is making us bring you whatever we are coming to give you. And hey, it is just a master architect here. And a master architect and Nigeria is still attacking. And that is what I love about this game. And that is what I love about them as well. They are not relaxing at all. No relaxing, no relaxing, guys. Yeah. I believe in this team, and I believe this team could just go to the highest and could just go to the maximum. And let me know your opinions and suggestions going into this game. Let me know what you think about the game. And if you just join us, make it a point to subscribe, turn on your notification bell, and let's make it happen. What a great and what a Massive, massive, massive. Remember, the next game coming on your way is going to be Leon versus uh, Guinea Bissau, the same group and the same group. And let's see what these two will also be able to get in. But hey, it is just a cake and a cake and a sweet one for that matter for Nigeria today. And five goals will be something that we can be able to lie on. 33rd minute of the game. Still the same thing, two goals to nil, and Nigeria is still passing, and they are still passing into this game. And believe it or not, we are ready. We are ready, and we are ready to get in and make it a master architect. Up till date, up till date, 33rd minute of the game, Sao, Tommy, and Principe haven't been able to get shot, nor shot on target in this game. 
and I think it's just a master project for them. And I think they are really, really, really doing well. They are really, really doing fantastic here in Nigeria. Is their master actor? Seventy-two percent of the ball possession Nigeria is sharing. Wow, unbelievable! With two hundred and twenty-six, yeah, two hundred and twenty-six at this moment passes and eighty-seven percent pass accuracy at this moment. What a statistics Nigeria is having, and they need to replicate. It needs to be replicated on the team. It needs to be replicated on the play, and it needs to be shown that they are masters of their own. Hey. We are masters of our, our own. We are part of our own camera. Yeah. Nigeria part of their own camera. And also, Sao and Principe also part of their own camera. But Nigeria is part of them more, more yeah. and more here. And I think it just be a master architect here. And, and hey, let me know. Let me know your suggestions. And, Everybody taking, everybody taking, Nigeria is taking it over and hey, I could probably, there should have been three goals to me here, but some of the passes are not really getting to and hey, they are just misplacing a lot and they are really, really, really. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, unbelievable. I can't believe this and I can't get it and I can't get the masterpieces here. But let's see how these two are really going to change everything for us because Nigeria failing to score more goals here will be a detriment for my support. Believe me, believe me or not, but it is just what it is and it is absolutely what it is. And guys, if you just join in, keep your comments coming. How many goals do you think Nigeria is going to win here? How many goals do you think is going to be? What are your scoreline predictions and who are to score those goals? Let me know in the comment section as well, because this is what we are and what we are is what we do. And what we do is what we bring to you. And what we bring to you is just the excitement and the excitement alone is okay for all of us to just go in and make it happen okay i don't know how you feel about this game but this is just great this is just masterpiece of a game in that 36 minutes into the game and it's still same story same story here and same story two goals to nil differentiating both sides and i think hey we are just masters of the game and nigeria is the master architect in this game and nigeria is absolutely showing the class here showing the momentum here showing the greatness here showing the can do spirit and if they keep it believe me no african team because i am voting for nigeria and senegal because right now they are the masters of africa having a lot of players having the players and having everything if they want to control the african football it's just gonna be simple and it's just gonna be simple but let's see how it's going to be but it starts here by scoring five goals to nil and did you believe me or not do you think the five goals will now come or not For now, I'm not 100% sure the five goals will be able to come in the game. But getting two goals in the first half, like that is basically the thing. And there's still more chance to probably get the third goal in this first half, then it will be a dungeon for them to get the second, the, like the two more or three more goals in the second half. <laughs> Let's see, because I just need a second goal to come in the second half, in uh, this first half. The third goal, I need the third goal to come in still so in this first half and probably I'll be okay. And still 37th minute is just Victor or Simhin and also uh, Simon's goal is differentiating both sides. And I think uniquely Nigeria are doing perfectly well. The principal are not even, even getting near the goal post of Nigeria. So the game is just played in midfield and also the half yard of principal. And this is why I love what Nigeria are doing. Mean, they know exactly what they are here for. And they know that they are too comfortable. They are taking them for granted. They are taking them.
for granted and go in school blessing what is gonna be and what is going to be happening in India. And guys, let me know your suggestions and let me know your opinions. If you just join in, make it a point to subscribe and turn on your notification bell. Also like the video as well and share to their friends and share to their friends and let them share to friends as well and go for that. So just be passing as well. Come on, this is full of basil and it's just basil. Are you excited? <laughs> Today I'm much, much, much excited, guys. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not? Nigeria is making it for themselves and my brother. Everyone is happy to see Nigeria doing it for themselves right here. Yeah, everyone is excited to see Nigeria doing it for themselves. And hey, it is just an amazing day, a great day. And hey, it's just a master architect. And I think it could just be a greater movement for both sides. And whoever the car fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, I think is great that is what i can only say great is the word and master architect is the adjective qualifying nigeria performance here 39 minutes into the game and still same story wow unbelievable this is just a architect of a game unbelievable this is just a great architect of a game and i'm just enjoying it and guys let me know what you really think and hey make it a point to join us and make it a point to make it a master architect here subscribe turn on notification bell keep your comments and i don't know whether you guys are afraid i don't know whether you are going into this game or why the comments are not coming let's build it together let's build the community together because the community is fast and Going and let's make it a for ourselves and whoever the car fit let them wear it and let them wear at this moment nigeria is the one wearing the identity fit nigeria perfectly and no doubt i need five goals and i need the third goal in any moment from now because they are allowing the respect to become comfortable in this game and i don't like it at all because at this moment they got it short but not short on target what a game and what a master architect of a game and what a beauty of a game we are having and guys just hit the subscription button you could be helping us to gain 2k 2k subscription here because that is our target this month and we have been postponing it for quite a number of months this month make it a point help us to reach the and hey, we'll be so grateful as well. And hey, let me know. And also, don't forget to keep your comments coming. Free kick to Nigeria at this moment. And now, Prince Pair uh, just gonna be making it a great moment as well. <laughs> Now, 40 minutes being played, and Nigeria still leading by two goals to zero. Wow. Comfortable leading the game. Comfortable What's a miss? I said, Niger I said it. Nigeria is making these people like they are, they are too comfortable to them. I don't like, most of the time, I don't like football. The one you get the chances, just go in and make it. What a chance and what a moment. Nigeria are just interested in shooting in their balls. They don't. They are not interested in opening spaces. Take time. The people are not uh, good enough. Take time and create spaces and be able to win. But they just. Everyone wants to score a goal, and that is what I don't like. Play as a unit. Play as a team. Create spaces because if you play like this and you meet a team that is very very good and they are good in their own way, probably Nigeria will be family. But if you play as a unit, you are creating spaces. You don't care who scored the goal, you don't care who scored the goal. And Ghana and Nigeria, that is our problems. We always talk to those who scored the goal. We always want to see those who scored the goals, but those who are working within the classroom, we don't see them. And it's killing our team, it's making our team like a boredom. You could see like whenever a player comes, the moment they, they just want to be scoring because when the more they score, the more their name are being mentioned in the uh, fans. And but those who are doing the grassroots, they don't see them. <laughs> it is wonderful, absolutely wonderful. We just need more and more and more and more from these guys, and I need more and more people 
them to just like we need more education in the football. Look at Ngolo Kante, how many goals has he scored for France? How many goals has he scored in Chelsea? Everyone is buzzing for him because they know the, what he's doing in the field of play. They, now, this is what is going to be hammering the Nigerian because everyone now wants to score. And that is not how it's supposed to be. Come on guys, come guys, let me know your opinions and suggestions. Let me know what you really think about this game because I am in for you guys and I'm in for Nigeria and I'm in for five goals. If you think you need five goals in this game, let me know in the comment section. If you think Nigeria can score five goals, let me know in the comment section as well because if Nigeria fails to get that five goals, believe it or not, I am just removing my hands on top of Super Eagles. Believe me. Because if so if, now the third goal has arrived, the third goal has arrived. Absolutely. I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you in the 44th minute of the game, the third goal is in, and now I slept with my two goals. And hey, they should bottle it and make it a massive for me because now it's certain that Nigeria can get that in. But hey, unless it's just happening, we are still waiting. And I started waiting and hey, this is what we've been talking. Eddie, you see what I was seeing. Now you see what I was seeing. I told you, Sal is not that like, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying they are not good, but sometimes it's about the composure, it's about the, the momentum, it's about the experience. And Sal don't have that experience when it comes to African football. They don't have that experience. But as they push your time to time, you see them in the Afghan Cup of Nation. But I don't think this year is for them. I don't think this year is for them. And Nigeria should be passed and they should be getting home to make it a master architect. So this is what Edward said. Agenda five more goals. Absolutely. This is the agenda. Five more goals. No more Niger. No more Niger. <laughs> Wow, unbelievable and unbelievable situation here and we are almost getting to first half of this game and Nigeria is passing on three goals to you. The master architect of this game, a great of this game and the solid sisters of this game and just out margin, just accurately or just making it a massive, massive one. It's just what we are, and what we are is what we are bringing into you, and what we are bringing is absolutely nothing but incredible game and absolutely master architect of a game. And hey, we are waiting for minutes of added on because it's already first 45 minutes of the game. What a game it is, and what a massive, massive game it is in Nigeria. I salute. But I still need that five goals. If the five goals is not coming, I'm taking my salute back. If it does not come now, two minutes of added time, then we are into one minute of it because I also feel that there wasn't much time to wait in this game. But hey, this is what we probably been getting here and this is what we probably been making here in Nigeria. What a performance, what a master architect performance in this game. Away from home. This is not like this is away from home and in half away from home for you to get three massive goals. Eddie, what does that mean? <laughs> away from home for you to get three goals in first half. It just means that so that means class. Nigeria, what Nigeria is doing over there is just amazing. You have an upper hand. You have the upper hand in this game. You already have the upper hand in this game. But the, the what is remaining for them to put in the goals, as we said? So now more, more goals, and probably more goals alongside with clean sheet will be a better day for Nigeria. More goals alongside with clean sheet will be a better day for Nigeria, and a clean sheet for them for that one is just already outstanding. Just the goals I wanted to reach five because Sipair is not actually good enough, and they are not able to break the defensive line of Nigeria since the 45 minutes of this game. And I think, hey, Nigeria is the solicitor. They've already solicited this. These three points have been already solicited. I'm waiting for them to just declare that the five goals is just it. agenda five goals for Nigeria. Absolutely, agenda five goals for them, and let me know what we 
and I wouldn't mind if for Simhin get hat trick to but hey anything is possible in this game and let me know your opinions and guys this is the first half absolutely the first half of this game nigeria three south tommy at home nil what a game what a massive 45 minutes a game what a craziest 45 minutes of a game and hey i am just a master architect here and what we do is what we do what we do is just what we love and what we love is what we are bringing i think this is what it is and this is what it is eddie let's go for the statistics because statistics do not lie all right yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, let's see what they are able to perform in the field because if you are not doing quite well, the statistics will open up your handles and wind will blow in. <laughs> so, Eddie, over to you. All right, the first half of the, the, the first half the sense of Nigeria isn't bad at all. It's, it's this first half could be won't even be up to if you combine the first half of the like, I don't think they're going to even perform up to this first half of Nigeria. That shows you how incredible Nigeria has been in this first half game. 11 shots and three, six on target. Out of this on target, three has been positive for them. That's three goals. 71 percent with both perception. With the ball passing 343 and 70-87 pass accuracy. That's so so good. That's so like that. It's a perfect day for Nigeria. It's a perfect game. It's a perfect day for Nigeria. But we saw Tommy one shot and now no shot of the letter. 29 book possession, 140. As I said, this is their first time in this competition. Probably. They don't have the experience as you said. And with that, I think it will take them some time uh, some to get the experience and everything. But for them to participate, if they are not able to qualify from this, uh, their group, I'm not surprised. Probably they can go back, do their assignments here, and they can probably go ahead and qualify for the next competition, uh, next group teams as well. They are 24, uh, they are coming, yes. So that's what uh, I think for them. But for this person, I'm going to do an incredible game for Nigeria. For doing an incredible game for Nigeria. Very good for Nigeria and very ma and master architect for Nigeria and Major is passing in the first 45 minutes of three good nil and three goals to nil and now see what is really happening in the entire 45 minutes of the game. Sao Tome and Principe had only one shot in the game, no shot on target with 29% of all possession, 141 uh, passes in the game, 70% pass accuracy, committed three fouls in the game, and yet it's just bottling, bottling and bottling and bottling. They had no corner, yet unable to get any goal or any form of target or any like goal no in the first 45 of this game. And I think uh, they are really need to do more and they need to do absolutely more. In the other hand, the Super Eagles, these statistics, this is the first time, first ever, I see the Super Eagles first half statistics make sense for me this is first ever i can't remember if maybe if i forgot 11 shots into the game nine six on target 71 percent of board possession three goals with 87 percent pass accuracy committed seven fouls in the game and also five offside in the game no yellow card no red card and four corners in the game what an amazing what a massive architect performance they have really done here and i think anything happening here would just be bottling for south and princess uh, principle and this is just what we are talking about when you are in the game you are in the game and when you are into winning everyone sees that oh, really this team is ready to win and they are ready to make it a master architect here but if you go into a game with the mentality oh winning it all I've already done it then in the end you don't just see what you were expecting but at the moment it is what it is yes the mental very soon okay
So uh, let's take a look at the table, how it looks like at the moment. And this is how the group table is looking. This is how the table is looking. And Nigeria is passing into the first position of the group table with Guinea Bissau as well, three points, zero point zero, and Sao Tome um, last with zero points as well. And today, Guinea Bissau is taking Serbia, and it will be a game of those. And it is going to be the second game of today coming on your way. But if you think otherwise, let me know in the comment section because it is absolutely massive and a great, great day for these two to make it a master architect. And guys, let me know what you think. It is just amazing, great day, absolutely great day. And I'm happy that Nigeria is taking this game into their own hands because if you do, you do. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. And hey, this game, this all this, this group shouldn't be something to worry Nigeria at all in their uh, quest to go to the African Cup finishing in 2013. But what can we say? It's just a massive, and it's just a great time. And I think they will be able to make it a great moment as well. And hey, let me know your opinions and suggestions. And if you haven't subscribed, make it a point to subscribe and turn on your notification bell as well. Like the video, if possible, share as well because this is just new day, new moment, and new suggestions to you guys. I pray. We are building slowly and we are building slowly and you could just be helping us build this community as the way we want it. And let me know what you really think. What are your suggestions? What are your opinions going into this game? Because I am already a master architect here. And let's see how the second half is going to be. Let's see how the second half is going to change. Because whatever be the case, Nigeria need to win it by five goals to nil or more because that is what I'm voting for Nigeria. That is what I want Nigeria to get in and make it happen because this is not good. This is not true. And it is just a day that you should be able to make a master architect here. So guys, the last name coming on your way today is going to be Liberia versus Morocco. So Morocco is going to Liberia to make it happen as well for themselves. And hey, this West African country is sometimes very difficult to face around, but this is Africa know how to play the West Africans. But hey, whoever they have fit, whatever you think and whatever you think is going to change, let me know in the comment section and let me know your suggestions in the comment section because I am just a master of my own company and I am just a master of my own company and whatever I think it is fine, whatever I think it is what we think it is the best for the community and let me know what you think, let me know what you think because hey, masters of our own come we straight on and we will live on and this three goals coming on in the face of Nigeria is something that we should be making more and we should be talking more. What a day and what a master architect of a day it is. And Nigeria three goals in first half doesn't here. I think more three goals will also come in the second half. Let me know what you think because Nigeria is the master architect here. And hey, if they keep this consistency, sometimes it's not all about what you have, it's about the consistency, it's about the mentality. And this time around, I think Nigeria has the right mentality approaching games. They have the consistency here, winning games. And what do they need again? It's just some little, little tactics, and it is it. And little, little tactics, and it is that is it for them. And hey, Nigeria wouldn't have problem doing it, but I wanted to see Nigeria then uh, walk up, but it didn't happen. But no way would they fail in this Afghan Cup qualification. Hmm. Let's see how this is going to be, and let's see how things are really going to be here. Because I am just who I am, and what I am is what I do, and what I do is what we are bringing to you, and what we bring to you is just the excitement, excitement all the way, and excitement all the way. Guys, what are you expecting in the second half? Let me know in the comment section, because your expectation is paramount. 
what we expected and what do you think second half is going to bring you. I cannot say much and I cannot do much. What I can do is Nigeria need to do more in the pitch. Forget about personal goals. Play as a unit. Play as a team. Gel together. Make it a maximum priority because if you are able to accomplish these three things, anything facing you will be shaken. Anything facing you cannot break through because you are playing as a team and you are playing as a unit. But today I see that most of them wants to go in and score goal. Hey, me, I score the goal. Or Simon's company, if the others are not able to make it happen, probably you could not. But today, the defensive of Nigeria was just solid because Prince Fair are not able to break through. Huh. Can you imagine? They are not able to break through. They are not able to make anything out of this game. I think the defensive nature of Nigeria was just blooming and blooming and blooming. And I think that was absolutely great. And that was absolutely massive, massive, massive. And hey, guys, stick to the ideology of this uh, community because, hey, we are here and we are here. And we are making it a master architect here. And we are masters of our own. And whoever they have fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, Nigeria is the one that should be worshipped right now because they broke the virginity of this game. They made it into three goals of the first half and make the game very, very exciting and a unique of a game. And I think the second half probably is going to be cracker, cracker of a game, massive of a game. And whoever it is, I think anything will just be happening, anything will just be changing here. And hey, it is just what it is and it is absolutely what it is and i am absolutely passing and i'm absolutely happy that things of this nature is really 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 exist wow 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 that is the word i can use wow that is the only because i'm so excited that i've never seen nigeria first half make this kind of performance for 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 the team and to, for them to come up with this kind of agility i think is absolutely master class i think it's absolutely beautiful and we just need to get in and get the second two goals and that will be it and that will be it for the team and bear in mind that this is just a cracker of a game and second half will be coming in a moment from now second half will be coming from in a moment from now and we could just be a great 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 opponent here and hey clean sheet i now need in this game clean sheet last two goals i think will be very very good because the last time nigeria failed to keep clean sheet against Sierra Leone at home but keeping clean sheet probably will make the defenders very comfortable will make the goalkeeper very comfortable and, and that would be that would be very very massive and guys it is just a master architect and let me know what you think the second half is gonna be and let me know what you think the second half is gonna be and i think it's going to be great and it's going to be a massive 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 turnaround from both sides and whoever they can fit be in mind it is just beautiful Beautiful, we call it master class, we call it, and I think hey lance and lance and lance and lance. Well let's commit and let's commit and let's commit and let's commit because who is it that we cannot do? What is it that, that we cannot do? But whatever we can do is the absolute masters of the game. And hey, remember Liberia will also be taking on uh, Morocco in the last game of the African Cup of Qualifiers today. And who do you think will probably make it a, a master architect here? Let me know and let me know because the second half will just be coming in a moment from now. Come on guys, let me know what you think. Keep your 
your comments coming, keep your architect coming because uh, today we are going to make it a brilliant day, a massive day for all of us as well. And hey, it's just timing and it's just timely, timing, timing, timing. And let me just get into the game because they could be starting any moment from now and they could be just getting any moment from now. And I think could probably also join us anytime, any soon. So who is gonna be who is going to make it a great point. Guys, it is just way, 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 way time that we enjoy this game than ever, than making yourself like wiped out as well because it's, this is a moment, enjoy the moment because Nigeria super eagles have played that moment. So you need to enjoy it and enjoy it the way it is supposed to be because tomorrow will be different enjoyment. Tomorrow will be different excitement. And hey, it's just a great and it's just great, great, great. And I think this too will be able to make it happen. Whatever we think, whatever we want is a moment that they have been created. And you need to just follow it. You need to just follow with it. And you need to just make it a master architect. Yeah, and I think hey, it is just the way we want it to be. It is the way we want it to be, and that is the way we want it to be. Mm -hmm. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Let's get in and let's get in and let's make it a great moment for ourselves and a great master architect for ourselves. Come on guys, come on guys, what is going on and what is going on? The second half has just begun and under one minute of it, it's still three goals to kneel for Nigeria and I think hey, we are here to make it great moment and we are here to make it a master architect and whoever the cap fit should be able to determine and make it a great, great, great tool for sure because these two are just absolutely, absolutely and absolutely dazzling. I won't be able to call it a game and I'll be able to call it a home until Nigeria get it five goals in this game. I'm waiting and I'm waiting. I'm still not satisfied because I am who I am and I love it and I give give this kind of momentum to my players and I give this kind of stress to my players and I need them to deliver it and I need them to deliver it as soon as possible. And guys, it is just way some and it's just massive 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 day come on i am who i am come on guys unbelievable Come on, what do you think and what do you think about the game and what are your opinions?
it's happening now and it's happening now and guys what i'm doing now the fourth is in and the fourth goal is in and hey i'm now waiting for the fifth goal right now and nigeria is the master architect here and nigeria is making it here and now it's just left with the last google and the last goal come on guys what do you think and what do you think about this game because it is just time to make it happen it is time it's call it the master architect here now we are waiting for the second goal, uh, the fifth goal here to make it a master architect and hey nigeria is buzzing and they are buzzing at any point here and every point here is just making it an exciting one for sure and i think hey these two are really 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 getting it on and they are getting on to this game i am who i am and what i am is what i do and what i do is just what we are and what we are is just absolutely exciting exciting is the name of the game and who is who come on guys i can't believe what i'm seeing but what i'm seeing is the replicate of the game and into 50th minutes of the game nigeria is leading by four goes to nil massive four goes to nil and absolutely massive four goes to nil and i can't believe what i'm seeing wow keep it on keep your game on and keep it on keep it. it's a master architect here and hey it is just solid 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 performance and hey what a game and what a game and what a game and i am just trying and trying and trying to just make sense out of this game but i'm not really making sense and Treme, Treme, Terem, Terem Murphy scoring the fourth goal and Victor <laughs> or Sim him I just want him to get hat trick today and I just please players help Victor or Sim him to get hat trick today please he needs to get hat trick today and he needs to get hat trick today after they Principal really have not been able to get a shot on target in the game. Still, same story for them. Absolutely, same story for them. And they are not buzzing in this game. Come on, this is just master architect, and this is just what we believe in, and this is what we think it should be happening right now. And Nigeria is making it a great move, and they are making it a massive movement. And hey. Get it. If you get it, just try to get it. If you still don't get it, try to get it. If you still don't get it, just forget about it because it's not everything that you will get at all. But hey, this is just a waste of performance from these two sides. Brilliant performance, massive performance, and they have really, really worked very well. They have really, really made a master architect here. And I think today is another day and another game. And hey, Prince Bear is not able to just call it their own. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Let's get in and let's get in and let's get in. I am so excited and hey, this is a down deal for Nigeria. This is an absolutely down deal for Nigeria. And now we are waiting for the fourth, fifth, fifth goal here. And Eddie is back, guys. Eddie, fourth goal has just come on in the early minutes of the second half. All right, so that is it. Your five goal agenda is still alive. Yeah, absolutely. because there's still there's still more time to go probably in this uh, to, before the second half comes to an end or before the game comes to an end. And now probably one and even since since goals can even come in, as you say, since since we're seven goals can, it's not possible for Nigeria. So that's that's it. That's they are just having it for themselves. But uh, with the look of things, I think uh, South probably won't be able to qualify from the game because they still have. More than more than uh, seven goes to probably seven different uh, goals difference. No, this seven. This could make it like nine, or uh, because the last game was five. They considered five in the last game. This, this making it eight minus eight. Minus nine or minus eight. Minus eight. 
Okay, so it means they had a goal in in the last game. Yeah. Okay. But Nigeria is still. But that means they are they are they are like. Yeah, I hope it's still over. Well, until the balls are rotten. Super Eagles all the way. Super, 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 super Eagles. Super of super. And I really admire today. And today's performance was just class. And I need them to keep that momentum because I don't want anywhere you just, I win this and I go, I win this and next time is this and all those things. But hey, this time round, I think they could be able to pass and pass very, very, very well in the team. And hey, I'm looking forward to see them just getting more, 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 and more momentum and building more momentum in African football as well. Because as you don't have for me, the whole team, they have a lot of guys, good guys out there. Just imagine Lukman playing in Leicester or uh, what's the name, Yanachu in Leicester. A lot of players I can't even mention. There are a lot of them, a lot of them. Or Sim Him and uh, uh, what you see most. Just, but when they come back, I don't know what is really worrying the team. Is it tacticality? Is it what? But let's see how this is going to be. Is it they lack discipline or what is really happening? But this time around, they need to make it a great moment because right now they have such players. We can't be determined in five years who they still have that players. And that is it. The final five goal is here. And the goal is here. Once what is strike from long distance and what is strike from long distance again. And Nigeria is just making it more. Now you believe even nine goals can come in this game. <laughs> I told you it's gonna be goal harvest for Nigeria and now five goals to be there. It's too much. Five, five goals, goals, five goals, five goals. They just need to go in and keep the relationship. Need to go in and make them want to come and make it a master architect for themselves because this is just absolutely class, unique and brilliant, brilliant, brilliant performance from my brothers and my brothers from Nigeria. And the next game coming up, Eddie is going to handle the captain and is going to begin at six, where seven million, Mama seven million will be playing alongside with Guinea Victoria and then Guinea Bissau and also hey the last game coming on the road today is going to be Liberia Austin Bobo as well. So let's see how these things are going to be working and let's see how things are going to be messier for Sao at home right now because things are getting harder and harder for them and it's just the replicate of the game what is in the game is just a replicate of what we thought and what we thought is what we believe and what we believe is just the game and the game in the totality we put it together then shave it shake shake and be able to tell you this is what we think about the game and today it's just working perfectly Come on guys, come on guys, come on guys. What are we gonna do and what are we gonna do? Because this full of like, excitement, we don't need it to go on, but we need it to for the momentum of the game and keep your comments coming as well. And Nigeria is just what we believe them to be. And at this moment, they are really moments of the game, they are masters of the game, and they are master owners of this game, and someone who just be present, and someone who just be making a great day for themselves. Come on. Now, now into 58 minutes of the game, it's still same story, five goals at this moment, Eddie. Yeah. Now, it's a long, it's going to be a long day for Sao Tome. It's going to be a very long day for them. But as at now, almost 60, 60 minutes we played, and we are down by five goals to zero. Wow. I don't know what to even say again. Yep. <laughs> What I going to say, except that this is just a, a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful time 
that everyone is going on to make it a great, great day for themselves. Too. Wow, unbelievable and unbelievable. And I think this is just something that we are all to be doing. And hey, Nigeria in the 59th minute of the game, looking great and looking fantastic. And they just need to don't keep, keep the momentum and don't lose the game and don't lose the game due to complacency and don't lose points because I really want them to keep the clean sheet here and I really want them to keep that clean sheet and keep that momentum going. Five goals away is just something that you should be thankful and hey and someone some people could be saying is uh, sour and president but once a sour and president are here to prove a point there's a reason why they build up to here there's a reason why they get and the seed goal has just come on and it is six goals to go and i told you it's gonna be goal harvest for nigeria and that is it now and that is it six goals in the 60th minute of this game maybe it will be seven goals in the 70th minute and eight goals in the ninth in the 80th minute and nine goals in the 90th minute and now it's just look like every 10 minute goal is going to come on in this game what a master game what a great game yeah i don't know but please bear south prince bear hi omonizer <laughs> omonizer eddie Frank is calling them. My guy is calling, is calling go. I can even go there to score a goal for myself. Can you? The guy is calling. Let me answer. All right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Nigeria harvesting goals for themselves. Harvesting goals for themselves. Such a nice day for Nigeria to probably go in. They make it for themselves. As it stands, see already sixteen sixteen minutes being played and Nigeria leading by six goal to six goal to nil. More goals to come, more goals to come in this game. Even two or three more goals can it's still possible to come in this game. And it's a corner kick for Sao Tome. Would they be able to even get a corner? Would they be able to even get a goal here? I don't think it's possible, but hey, they do do it for themselves. So Nigeria doing it for themselves, what they're doing for themselves, what 
52 games we played Nigeria leading by two goals, six goals, no, sorry, six goals, leading six goals. And now they are topping the group with six, po- uh, six points because they won their first game on this as a second game in the qualification. And now they are already leading in this game by six goals to nil. The seventh goal have arrived. The seventh goal have arrived. I told you. I told you. I told you. Okay. Now you had the seventieth minute, but I told you if Guinea, if Guinea Bissau are able to score some five goals, Nigeria should be able to score ten goals. I told you. And now I'm buzzing, and my every support is for Nigeria at this moment of the game. And I think they really pretty deserve it. And they have done a massive job here. And hey, it is what it is. I probably know this this game was going to go this way, and it was going to go this way. But too much of goals like this doesn't also make the fans enjoy the game as possible. So probably some people might have even left because Nigeria is scoring more goals here. <laughs> But believe it or not, next game will be exciting and next game will be absolutely exciting. And let's see how it's going to be and let's see how things are really going to be working for sure. But whoever they can fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, we are waiting and waiting. But Nigeria are master architect of this game. The duplicates, of course, just making the goals like they are, like, 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 they are like drinking water they just call them like i don't know but let's see how this is gonna be and let's see how things are really going to be but hey victor or sing him victor or sing him i wanted him to get a hat trick but yet up to date he hasn't been able so lukman scoring the last goal here at timola lukman another leicester star and hey he is very very good in his own way another goal has arrived oh, okay hey, another goal has arrived it goes <laughs> and when i tell you something you need to believe me you need to believe me it goes. It goes in try, the game. Try, 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 no, try. I'm out. I'm out. It goes. Wow. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So it's just like <laughs> the sitter is just sitting like I, want, I wanted to go, I wanted to go in to make something for myself, but it's too late. And you you need to do because the other this in the exercise at six and all how this no, set uh, no, no, investment investment. Oh, okay, okay, okay. For good, for good, but now the, the option, there's no more options over there. Oh, okay. okay. So, uh, uh, yeah, that is all. The next option is over 10.5. 10.5, means they need to pour 11 goals, and 11 goals can, cannot come into this game that are uh, by. But 66 minutes, maybe 30 goals can still come. Who knows? Hmm. Yeah, that would have been the best option. But hey, let's imagine. I told you. I let's told imagine. You. Going for like even eight goals, seven goals a, a, a look could have hit you like what French one or trap hit us. Or fifty more than fifty yourself. Uh, I told you, I told you. Thousand, thousand grand, two thousand grand. Chai! <laughs> Chai. <laughs> I could, have, I could have seen this thing coming. Yeah. I saw it, but I saw it. I told you, I saw it. But yeah, probably the next game. You, you, you will look into the next game. But, but it's not going to be like that again. It's not going to be. The odds is not going to be like the way it is today. They will drop the odds like something. No, but it's going to be like, not for straight team, but for goals as well. Probably more than three goals, more than four goals, you see. Not that much. No. No, even at home, there's going to be Nigeria home. Mm-hmm. Even Nigeria home, Nigeria can still score this kind of goals. But the problem is, the this you know, the odds is going to be very, very, very low because now they know how to score this kind of this. Thing. 
Wow, unbelievable. Great game. Nigeria is the master architect here, and it goes to the is something that they are really relying on. It's something that is looking into them and it's looking beautiful and absolutely massive. And whoever they cut it, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, I think they are really, really getting on better and better and better. And what class, what the game, and what a cracker of a game these two are having and Nigeria are making me so excited and so beautiful. Wow. So beautiful, so beautiful. I can't believe it, but it is happening right now. I can't believe it, but it is what it is. You know, I mean, if suppose now was on the page playing for South Korea. Yeah. I said so now the place for South Korea would be all their requests that the game should just come to an end. Probably at this time. Yes, it will the game. Of course, of course, that is what they will be praying for. But hey, let's see how this is going to be because we are almost getting to 70th minute of this game. I don't know how this is going to be, but it's going to be pretty, pretty, pretty tough. I need some address as well. This is just master architect and Nigeria is just buzzing, buzzing here in the uh, 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 in the uh, 71st minute of the game. It goes at this moment and I hey, oh, seeing him that I just wanted him to get good in, to get hat trick here, but hey, unable to make it. But let's see how this is going to work out because to have really, really determined and they have really, really done very well here. And let me know your opinions and suggestions. Let me know what you think about the game because, hey, it is what it is and it is absolutely what it is. And whoever the graphic should wear and should be able to wear it. Let me know your opinions and suggestions going into this game because what we do is what we are doing right now. Whoever the graphic let them wear it and let them wear it. Eddie, yeah, yeah. So I think I could probably, I don't know, because the pass will be coming in 56, but then this game will finish as well. I don't know. The, no, no, don't worry, don't worry. I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I will walk to the distance and just take it because the time will be finishing between the between the oh, it will be too late for me. I need to I need to leave, but I don't know what time. But well, let's see how this is going to be, and let's see how this is going to be. 
Let's go, guys. Let's go, guys. Let's go, guys. This is probably them. Omo Niger is making it a 73rd minute of this. Just level with some few minutes. <laughs> 17 minutes for the night to 19 minutes and the game is over i'm begging the officials to they shouldn't add more than two minutes in the second half as well Come on, guys! Come on, guys! It's whatever the cup and whoever the cup fits will be able to make it happen. And let's see how things are really gonna be working. And let's see how things are really going to be a master architect here. And hey, it is absolutely buzzing and absolutely beautiful for Nigeria. I can't remember when was the last time Nigeria are able to get eight goals, score eight goals in a team. But today it happened, and it happened all thanks to the players and hey they are really pretty they are really really have done a lot here and they have done massively well here and i think it's just beautiful what a game and what a massive 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 one game they have shown here and i think it is just time for us to give thanks to the players because this is what they can do on a brighter day this is what they have been able to achieve for nigeria and hey this goes will forever be remembered each goes is a massive 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 game as well for the players and i think they have played it down very well kudos to the players and kudos to everyone and hey whoever the car fit should be able to wear it and i think nigeria have done everything necessary here and have done everything mentally humanly here to keep it alive and to keep it a master architect here wow now just 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 15 minutes or 14 minutes into the game and it's still same story come on guys come on guys we are waiting and we are waiting and we are waiting for everton and i think this was classic performance this was absolutely cracker performance and nigeria leading the pace and nigeria doing everything why another okay this is corner for nigeria come on this is beautiful and this is absolutely beautiful and guys if you just join us and you are new you know how we do it it's just a momentum and a master architect and hey this is who we are and what we are is what we do and what we do is just what we are bringing to you and what we are bringing to you is what we love and what we love is what is on your screen right now nigeria passing with eight goals to nil in this game hey can you remember the last time can you remember the last time what is paining most is what Simhin have not been able to get hat trick no player have been able to get a hat trick in this game and I think it's fair enough, absolutely fair enough because everyone wants to be a star, everyone wants to get in and be scoring goals. That is the problem of our teams nowadays. But they could have been assisting him to get that hat trick. But hey, it's just bottling in, bottling in, and bottling in. <laughs> Can this be a go? Thank you. 
Come on, is it a goal? <laughs> this is how nah, we do it. This is how we go to each other. And here is 78th minute of the game. We just left with 12 minutes for the game to kick start. And hey, this is just amazing, amazing, amazing performance. And Nigeria all the way, the Super Eagles all the way, and they are the real brightest. They are the new prize in, in, in town now. The Super Eagles are the new prize in town now, and they are really doing it perfect here, and they are really doing it absolutely perfect here. And let me know what you think, and let me know your opinions, suggestions going into this game, because this is what it is, and what it is is what we are enjoying, and it's just the replicate of the game, and clean sheet with East Coast is what Nigeria is enjoying right now, and 11 minutes to the end of the game, plus other minute time. Charlie, let me attend the chapel. Take over. Over to you. Okay. In the 80th minute of the game, and Nigeria leading eight goal to zero. Nigeria still leading eight goal to zero. <laughs> Nigeria still no good for themselves in that game. Team Niger all the way today, eight goals against Sao Tome. They are doing all the needs to plan, they are doing the necessary in this game. And don't forget if you are new to the channel, subscribe. If you are new to the channel, subscribe. This is actually a sports for you. Stay tuned, stay connected after this game. There's another game coming your way at 6. Stay connected, stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. You know how we do it. And show us some love by hitting uh, by liking the video as well.
82 minutes being played, 82 being played in this game, and it's still 8 goes to 0 in favor of Nigeria. So a few more minutes to go, a few more minutes to end the game. Nigeria have it there for making it for themselves over here. The this is it. Will be coming. Mm -hmm. This is it, and this is it. I'm not sure last goal will come, but anything can still happen this game. But nine goals is enough. And uh, Nigeria have disrespected South too much, and they should forget about scoring last goal again. And at this moment, South are defending everywhere in the field. Don't want to concede more. But is it that Nigeria is too small? Nigeria is too hard for them, and they are too hard for them. And let's see how this is going to be. I give them five goals, but they have exceeded that and make it eight goals. And hey, they really want me to still support them as well. The Super Eagles really want me to support them, and that's why they are going in with this master class game and master class <laughs> of, a, of a position. And hey, I don't know what to even describe it. And what I can say is Nigeria is working now. And absolutely. Super Eagles is working now and this mentality they keep it up. Hey, we will see the trophy going to Nigeria. We will see African Cup of Nations trophy going bring, to Nigeria. Bring me my stone, bring me my stone because the knife go has already up. The knife go is in. God, what is happening to <laughs> Sao? Sao is not just 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 what is really happening nine goes now and hey we are looking into it and we could just be looking into several things here and nigeria is master masters in this game they are masters and master class of this game and they have done everything necessary here and guys if you just join us and you are new you know how we do it make it a point to subscribe turn on your notification bell also like and share the video if possible and we are just on to it and we are just on to it right now. Come on guys, come on guys, come on guys. At this moment, just four minutes to 90 minutes of this game plus at that time, then we could be buzzing and we could be buzzing. And hey, let me know what you think and let me know what you think about the game. The, 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 the officials should, should even forget about adding additional goal. I, I, I should not to the game. game. Because there's no way. But you know, games like this, the more if you don't take time, so that's where they will even add 10 minutes into this game. I don't even know how they talk about their additional minutes of time. At games like this, you don't need to add time again because there's no way their opponent can come back into this game. <laughs> that is why in Africa. Well, are you going to see the greatest comeback ever in history? <laughs> <laughs> this greatest comeback is not possible. <laughs> even if even if Nigeria left the pitch and allow only the goal i don't think and allow only the goalkeeper i don't think it's just possible to come by these nine goals within these minutes but let's see how this is gonna be and let's see how things are really gonna be and hey it's just a great moment and great moment and super eagles are super eagles they are just flying higher and higher and higher
this is it and this is it and this is it now we are just into uh two minutes to 90 minutes that's additional minutes time and it will be over let's see how this is gonna work out for uh both sides but hey do you think nigeria also just i think if they make it nine they should just get additional goal to make it 10 because i like even numbers you not cool numbers. you that you don't, huh? you don't you see that you that you don't you don't you are not even expecting the uh the, the nine goal now you have yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that's not good. Because odd number, it doesn't. They should just add it, and it will be it. Uh -huh. They should just add it to be ten goals, and that is it. Except for the goalkeeper, all of them had their share. Wow. That is it, that is it, then that is it. Just one minute to 90 minutes and plus other minutes and then the game will be over. And now we are looking into both sides to see how this will be working and whoever they can fit, let them wear it and let them wear it. And at this moment, I think it fits everyone perfectly. And everyone is passing and whoever is passing, let me know what you think because it's just an amazing architect of your work here and hey, this is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So I'm begging the referee, I'm begging the officials to add more minutes into this game. I'm begging them, just one minute and it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> but they will add, who knows? These people, they don't like this kind of, they will add the minutes that they will have to add. So 19 minutes now, the 19 minutes now, we are now playing it into additional minutes in the, uh, let's see how many minutes they are going to add this time. Come on, fingers crossed. They're going to add about four minutes, believe me, you see, I'm telling you. I'm going to add four or five minutes here. Come on guys, come on guys, let's get in and let's make it a greater moment and let's make it a massive moment and it's almost, almost, almost over for Sao and Tay. Nigeria was messless, they were messless in their home of Sao and scoring them nine goals is not the point, but hey, how are they going to be and how will they keep this momentum of scoring? Come on, they are not even showing us the added time in itself. Penalty awarded. To who? Nigeria. That is it. That is it. That is it. Then goes. Or they should give it to Sir Osim Him. They should give it to Osim Him. To just get his satire. Two minutes of added time, and it's just playing like this. The penalty is on, and it's been scored, and that is it. Then I told you they should just make it even number, and the referee have helped them <laughs> to make it an even number right now. And I bet you he should just close the game after the penalty, but he refused unless the two minutes have just added on, and I need to be going on.
All right, so it's over, Eddie. <laughs> it's over, Eddie. It's well, over. Yeah. The long, so guys, day, the long you, day for Sao Tome has finally come to an end. Nigeria leading them 10 goals to me. So is a catastrophe. Mm, that's catastrophe. And thank you very much, guys, for joining in. Eddie, your last words. Then probably. All right, so probably stay tuned. Join us in the next game. See you in the next game. Bye yes. for now. See you in the next game and bye for now. And probably when let's see how it's gonna work out. And hey, thank you very much for being here. And without that, peace.